And off the top of five, it is a Fox 5 exclusive. D.C.'s deputy mayor for public safety and justice, Chris Geldart, is in trouble tonight for this physical altercation in a parking lot in Arlington. And tonight he is charged with assault and battery. That incident, as you can see, caught on camera. Fox 5 Sarah Fox live tonight in Arlington with more on her one-on-one -on -one with the victim. Sierra. Dustin Woodward is a trainer here at Gold's Gym who says D.C.'s deputy mayor, Chris Geldart, grabbed him by the neck in this parking lot. He says he can't help but think about how this could have ended much worse. I mean, it's a little frustrating, right, because he, he's way too big to be trying to be a bully, and especially with his position. Um, something should be done. But it, it's, it's not okay. We've been dealing with him a while at Gold's, at multiple locations, actually. That's how we even figured out who he was. So it's something needs to be done because you can't just abuse your power like that, right? Like, that's, that's very frustrating on my end. The whole physical altercation was recorded. Dustin got permission to use this surveillance video, and you will only see it exclusively here on Fox 5. D.C.'s Deputy Mayor Chris Geldar is on the right. Dustin is on the left. According to Arlington Police, this whole back-and-forth argument stemmed from Chris allegedly opening up his car door and hitting Dustin's girlfriend's parked car. The dispute escalated to the point where Dustin says Chris was cussing and screaming, causing him to turn around and tell him to shut up. That's when you see Chris get in Dustin's face in a confrontational style. They're chest to chest and Dustin says Chris put his hands on his throat before he was able to push him away. Today I asked Mayor Muriel Bowser if she thinks this is acceptable behavior from someone on her leadership team and per usual she didn't want to answer our questions. I haven't seen it and I won't You're be looking at it now. Oh, this I actually won't. Actually, I asked you for it earlier uh, where I could review it and that's where I'll review it in my office. You can see it right now, though. We're showing but you the I'll video. Show, I'll review it in my so office. So you're going to speak with us later about this at a different time? No, actually, I probably won't. Why not? Because I asked you for some information that you had and you didn't give it to me. We're giving it to you right now. Well, you can give it in to me in my office, but thank you for your question. So when can you. we meet in your office to do this, Mayor Bowser? Susanna, when can we meet thank in her you, office? Guys. After several calls to D.C. Mayor Bowser's office and them refusing to respond, they finally sent Fox 5 this statement saying, we take any accusations seriously and are reviewing the matter. While it is under review, Deputy Mayor Geldar is on leave. Unfortunately, it sounds like something that happens to a lot of people, a dispute over something minor, and we hope it is resolved quickly. We do want to make it clear that the victim we spoke with says that he did not know who Chris Geldar was until after the incident. Again, the video you're looking at is exclusive to Fox 5, so stay with us for our next report coming up at 6, where you will only see it here again. Police tell me that they did call to notify Chris Geldar of the warrant he turned himself in and has been released until he has to appear in court again. He is charged with assault and battery, and Chris Geldar is D.C.'s deputy mayor of public safety and justice. Back to you.